Hello, detective. Was everything all right yesterday? You seem to leave in quite a hurry. Is everything okay? Not quite, your highness. Remember I was telling you about the strange goings-on in that trailer park outside the Magical Kingdom and the possibility of having a serial killer on our hands? Yes, detective, and that there was something strange going on with a girl named Katie Perkins. She had showed up out of nowhere, right? Yes. Well, your highness, it turns out that Katie Perkins is not who we think she is at all. I'm 100% sure that Katie Perkins was in fact evil little Kelly. What? You can't be serious, detective. Are you sure? By the description I got off the trailer park locals and the fact that little Kelly's old doll was named Katie Perkins, yes I am. But detective, I thought she didn't have her memory the last time we seen her. And she still doesn't have her memory, your highness. It turns out that she was killing people while she was sleepwalking. She had absolutely no idea what she was doing. I can't believe this. And where is she now, detective? Do you have her in custody? No, but we believe she's dead. She jumped off a very high cliff into a strong current river. There's no way she could have survived. So I guess that's the end of evil little Kelly, detective, right? I guess so, your highness. It most certainly looks that way. Oh, I can't wait to tell little Kelly. She'll be so happy it's all finally over. She's out on a date with little Donnie at the moment. Those two seem to be getting on great. A beautiful princess and a handsome prince. The perfect match. It most certainly sounds like it, your highness. Romulus, did you see the news? Yes, I did. A girl with no memory that commits murder. Sounds like our princess. I think we might have found her by the sound of things, but she's on the run again now. Indeed. It seems she must have been committing these murders without knowing somehow. It's nice to know the evil is still inside her. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty crazy. So what do we do, Romulus? We find her, Hegarty. It's finally time for the princess to come home. Oh, this is so exciting, Romulus. I can't wait to start doing some more evil plans. Steady on, Hegarty. We'll have to find her first, and then we have to get her memory back. Ugh, sounds like a lot of work, if I'm honest. Can we go to McDonald's first? No, Hegarty. We've done enough goofing around the last few weeks. It's time to get back to work. Oh, fine. I am excited, though. The Tree Amigos finally back together again. You know what this means, Romulus. Time for the best friend song. No, Hegarty. Don't sing that song. And we're the tree best friends that anyone could have. We're the tree best friends that anyone could have. And we'll never ever leave each other because we're the tree best. Hello, Cletus. How are you doing? A lot better now, Detective. Thanks for asking. What can I do for you? I was just calling in to check up on everything. Uh, how's CJ? Oh, he's much better now. He's coming home from the hospital today. 
That's great news. He's very lucky you found him when you did. I know, detective. I don't know what I would have done if I lost him. So, any word from Katie, if that's even her real name? As I said before, I can't really tell you much about Katie's real life. It's extremely confidential. And Cletus, I appreciate you respecting this. I know the media have been asking a lot of questions lately, but don't worry. They'll have something else to report soon and move along. And the answer to your last question is no. There's no sign of Katie yet. I'm sure her body's out there somewhere, detective. I don't think she could have survived that fall in rapid river current. The one thing I can't tell you is that we can never underestimate that girl. But I do believe she's dead. I think the world is safe from Katie Perkins.